coffee is the part of most people's daily routines. Here are 10 ways how to store coffee beans correctly to retain their quality, freshness, and flavor. How to store ground coffee beans. Coffee beans are seeds of the coffee plants, which are the source of coffee. Mostly found inside the red or purple fruit, which is referred to as a cherry, and they are mostly dried to increase their lifespan besides preserving the seed's scent and flavor. Here are some ways that you can store coffee beans correctly to retain their quality, freshness, and flavor. 1. Use airtight containers. For coffee to retain its freshness and flavor as long as possible, store it in an airtight container. Rather than that, storing coffee in retailed packages may not be the best way for long-time storage. 2. Purchase the needed amount. Buying extra coffee might lead to wastage. You will notice that coffee starts changing its flavor almost instantly when you open its packaging. In case you end up buying coffee in large amounts, you might as well consider dividing it into smaller portions as every time coffee is exposed to air, it loses its flavors and natural scent. 3. Do not store coffee near strongly scented foods. Coffee has a strong ability to absorb other odors and replacing it with the coffee scent. It may alter coffee's original taste if it's stored near such foods as onions and garlic, among other foods. For the coffee lovers, this might sound more as a disappointment as coffee generally loved for its taste and scent. 4. Freezing the coffee beans. Coffee should be stored as soon as possible, especially after the original seal has acquired broken. There are, however, different views on whether coffee should be refrigerated or not. Putting a bag of coffee beans in a freezer, when you get it out, it does not taste the same. 5. Store the coffee in shelves. Ground coffee and whole beans coffee should be stored in a shelf away from sunlight, moisture, and heat. Coffee packed in sachets should be crossed with a rubber band before storage to prevent air and moisture from entering. One should avoid storing the coffee on shelves and cabinets that face the light as coffee and sun do not rhyme. 6. Vacuum Sealing Vacuum sealing equipment is now affordable and readily available in retails near you. These machines use food saver bags, customarily sold in rolls or individual canisters. 7. Do not throw away the stale beans. People buy freshly roasted whole bean coffee in small and enough amounts so that they can finish them before it begins to lose its flavor. However, since that is not so often the case, one can use stale beans to brew the fresh ones, which refers to cold brew. 8. Store coffee in a well-ventilated room. A ventilated room simply refers to an airy place, open to fresh air, and dried without moisture. It may as well wind up the other storage ways of coffee as it only narrows down to the best way to store coffee generally. 9. Grind and roast green coffee beans yourself. If you have time to spare each morning, you can grind and roast the coffee yourself. Usually, when you buy pre-ground coffee it tends to go stale faster compared to whole beans. Be sure to keep them in an airtight container for the first few days to allow the carbon dioxide gas to escape before using them. 10. Storing coffee in bulk. In most cases, operators prefer to store coffee in bulk rather than in bags. The choice of bulk storage may be due to factors such as the bulk coffee reducing the space of the room required for coffee in bags and reducing the cost of labor. In contrast, the packaging process for bags and unpacking coffee takes up a lot of time, and the consideration of bulk coffee provides quality coffee and well-tasting coffee. With this, and following every way of storage to the latter, quality coffee is guaranteed, and there are fewer or no cases at all of the spoilt coffee.